everybody welcome back uh, we're going to do another tutorial for you today we've had some feedback that some people are finding the teddy designer top a little tricky at the neck and the collar so Cheryl is going to take you through putting it together and I'll do the filming and um, hopefully we'll help you get there in the end if for anyone who's having some um, tricky parts getting it um, to sit nicely at that neck so the garment um, the pieces that Cheryl's about to sew together um, have already been pre block fused and so we're doing this pattern piece here the facing and the neck facing here um, so I'll take you over to the machine and we can get going okay so here we go hi Cheryl hello <laughs> So, um, so the fabric that we're using is a washed linen. We actually are selling this on our site. We've made quite a few pieces in it. So we just um, grabbed some to make um, the Teddy designer top. So the short version. And Cheryl is doing the back neck facing. Just putting a lovely label on. Okay. okay. So, so here we have the collar which has already been fused. Mm -hmm. So I'll now bag it out. So quarter inch seam. All around the outside edge. The right sides together. Yep. So we can trim the curves. Mm -hmm. Just to adjust the bulk. bulk. Yep. Now we stitch on the under collar or the upper collar. So we edge stitch the, the under collar. Had a bit darker than lighter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And now we press this flash. Mm -hmm. Okay. Grab your iron and just roll it and flatten it. Mm -hmm. So now, well, 
join them together along the top. Okay, so we match up the notches. And you just run a stitch along quarter of an inch in. shoulders already. Okay, the front and back. Yep. Okay, that's pretty oh, easy. And yep. Yeah. Beautiful. So that's the shoulder seam. Yep. And then I've locked. Yep. And I've joined the lock. The face seams together, which have been fused. Mm -hmm. Is that the centre front or the centre back? S this is the centre, centre back. front. Centre front. So we match up all the notches to the neck. Mm -hmm. Because this can stretch because it's cut on the cross. Oh, very good point. Okay. So you mm -hmm. have a we starting, that's the centre front neck. Centre front? Yes. So you start a centimetre in. Can we just have a look at that? So It just sits flat around the edge. And come around to the other shoulder. Match the nicks. Follow that down to that point. Okay. Okay. So now we put our face in on this. So right sides together. Right and that's sides. Center, back, center. So shoulder. Shoulder. Centre back, shoulder, Where the collar meets Sorry. their 
that junction, mm -hmm. you've got a centimetre seam up, for, up the front and a centimetre there. So we start where that pin is, right on that point where the collar finishes. Okay. A centimetre in. Okay. Make sure your needle goes in and back stitch. Continue around the collar. Covering that stitch that you've put to stay stitched with the collar. Down at the point, we've got the same thing we started off. Centimetre in, right on the junction where the collar sits. So that's that. So you stitch down to that pin. Junction. Mm -hmm. So Beautiful. we clip in the curves mm -hmm. so that we have a bit more at the back neck. So when you do your stay stitch, see where that is. Beginning of a collar. This is the centre front of the collar. This is what it's supposed to look like when you finish. So here we go again. Okay. Take two. Okay. Let's get in close. So you put the pin at the bottom so that, oh. see, you can see the pin come out Hang there. On. I've got bad focus, just wait. Yep. Okay, so we take that pin and match it the other side. Mm -hmm. Whoops. Sorry. It's fine. So we put the pin in. It's fiddly. It's fiddly. This is why we're doing the cheat actually, because people have found it difficult and Cheryl's an amazing sewer, so it can be tricky for her, so it can be tricky for lots of people. Okay, we'll just check. So checking you've got it in the right position. Yeah. So there we have it, it matches up. Okay, so you sure? Yes. Mm -hmm. we, we actually just did the centre front but the pin was off slightly so we had to pull the thread out um, and go again. So I guess this is probably the part that people are finding the trickiest okay. and you can see the amount of fiddling that Cheryl's doing to get though that point to meet. So that's where it all begins. In okay point. so here we go. Cross fingers. Centimetre seam up to that point. Okay, let's hope this one worked. Okay, fingers out. There you go. Yes. Focus. So there you go, it matched up. So now mm -hmm. we we'll join up the facing to the same point. Turn it over. Now match 
to pin in at the bottom of the seam through to the bottom of the seam on the other side. Okay. Right, let's go. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, so when you turn it round, there you go. It's just a pressing. Yes, now we press it. Okay. Done. Do you need to clip any of that off the Well, way you, can. You? you can. You can help trim that off way now. So I will overlock it now. Mm -hmm. Come up about three inches. Go up to there. Turn it over. Mm -hmm. Now where are you? I'm at the neck. Mm -hmm. Turn it over. Overlock down together. Mm -hmm. So now we overlock the facing. You can start from the side. So overlock the facing now. Mm -hmm. Open the seam. Center front. Okay. Just maneuver it around. the wrong side facing, mm -hmm. sitting at the bottom. Okay. Okay, Lovely. so we can catch that down so the facing doesn't jump up at you. That's the wrong. Mm. So just do a little catch with your plane machine. So we have the facing, we've overlocked, trimmed it away a little and we'll just My thread came. Never mind, these things happen. So quick at it. Alright, okay, so here we go again. So fold that back a bit mm -hmm. and just catch it. Press it flat. Okay. Okay, so, so that should do just a good press sit. job to get that. Yeah. Area. Okay, so we'll press it up now and then we'll put it on the mannequin and have a look, yeah? Okay. Thanks. Very much. Okay, so this is the teddy. Cheryl went ahead and she finished off the whole top. So this is the collar. You can wear the collar uh, folded down like so, or if um, you want a bit more of a dramatic look, you can pull it up like this. So it's uh, in our linen. That's Lynn, our amazing pattern maker. <laughs> okay, there you have it, and that's the front neck. Hope that's helped somebody out there um, give this one a crack.